and welcome back to another video. So today I'm going to be showing you guys how to download the woman rig and how to insert it into Blender and add your Roblox texture to it. So let's get started. You're going to need this link here. It will be in the description um, and then it will bring you to this page, uh, woman rig. And then you just download it and then once you have it downloaded, you can open it up and then you'll have a file so once you open that file you should have like in blender you just you just click on the file and then it should automatically open blender and it should look like this and it does look a bit complicated but it's it's will get easier so first thing you're gonna do is you're going to delete the mouth and the head so you select it and be sure not to select any of the rigs just click x on your keyboard and then delete and the same for the eyes and the head and also there's a tongue which you should also select and um, and then you just have the body here another thing that you guys have to do is you need to insert your texture to this thing um, but so you can do that you have to download your texture your Roblox characters texture with Roblox studio a plugin and the tutorial for that will be in the description yeah but once you have that done you click anywhere on the body and you go to this side I'll just drag it out so it's a bit larger so over here you make sure you selected something Make sure you selected something, and um, so here, and if you go down, you'll see this. Uh, it's just some checkered circle, and so you click on that, and then over here, you'll have this, and for you guys, it probably looks something like this, because I dragged it out. So you see this, you're just gonna click X, and then this should turn gray or white. And don't worry if this is not pink with you guys if it's not pink then just click up here and select texture because if it's on material then you see it's white um then just click texture and then yeah so then you're gonna click new um and then go down here to base color and just click here or you might have a dot here but you click here you select image texture open and now wherever you have your um, texture saved or like there's a thing you're it it won't say what um, you saved it to so I did not save it to this I have like my body texture uh, it's just gonna say your username and then texture so PNG and then you select a open image and then it should appear so don't go looking for the thing that you saved it as because it won't appear. And then you just have to do this for all of the textures, for all every single body part. So then when this is done, you're probably wondering, um, where's the head? So to add the head, you're just gonna go to the top here and then click file, go down to import and then wavefront obg and you're just gonna so file import wavefront obg so then you click on that and then this will open you just go to where you saved it and then you're gonna it's gonna look like this something like that i have more saved but so i have where's my head so i have it to me obg there is usually going to be something there's gonna be a cube and like this paper it's two of the same thing and you're gonna see it's like mtl or obg you're just gonna go to where you saved it and this one's gonna be how you saved it um so it's the name that you saved it as and you're gonna choose the obg not the mtl so this is it then you just double click open it and i don't know how it's gonna look like for you for me it always just kind of looks a bit different um yeah sometimes it's see-through i don't really know why it's like this but i've i just dragged it to the side so 
You're going to click over here to rotate. If I drag it out, you'll see it better. But um, so you're just going to rotate. For most of the time, it's supposed to be white. So I think this is looking forward. And so you're going to just exit out because this has the texture of this. So you're now, so this is how it's supposed to look like you for you guys. For me, it's was see-through because it still had the texture for my body um, but my body texture does not include my head so it's see-through so you're just going to do the same thing new base color image texture open you're going to go where you saved it and here's the thing um, it usually confuses the two files so you should save it into a separate file because I have a separate file for all the heads and then I can then I know which one it is so then now the textures in it and you just drag it on and it's not always perfect but in this case we were lucky and now just I don't know adjust it so it looks natural and so normal well guys, that's how you add your texture to the woman rig, and I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Don't forget, the links are in the description, and I'll see you guys in the next video. Peace out!